Hello everyone, welcome to my channel PrevailCircuit.com. This is the first foremost video of the learning session of 8051 Keel and Proteus. So who should join this learning path? This path is for the ones who want to make things goals with the help of electronics. And secondly, who want to make career in electronics and programming. Thirdly, who want to learn microcontrol programming and electronics starting from beginner to advanced. Now, after this learning session, what should be the takeaway for the video sessions? Now, firstly, you will learn about microcontroller. Secondly, Keel. And thirdly, Proteus. So now the basic question arises here are what is 8051 and why are we learning 8051 and there are lots of microcontrollers which are far better than 8051 then why are we learning it. So firstly what is 8051? 8051 is an IC which can be programmed. We are learning 8051 because it is very easy to program using C language and very easy to understand how to program. So there are many other microcontrollers which can be programmed using C language but uh, using 8051 should be the first step for every programmer who want to learn programming embedded systems. Now one thing about 8051 is that it is a basic microcontroller manufactured by Intel company in 1981 and long before many of us have ever born. Now, what is Keel? Keel is a software which is used to write programs which runs on 8051 microcontroller. So we can see that Keel is an IDE. So what does Keel do? It gives a space to write program as, a, as an editor program and it converts our program into something called hex executable file which can be understood by 8051 IC. So uh, this is the short introduction of Keel. As we go further, we will learn more about Keel. And thirdly, what is Proteus? Proteus is a simulation software which is used to check the working of electronic components by connecting uh, one component with another or a group of component. And after applying power, we can check the working and the response in the software. Therefore, in our future learning sessions, we will be writing our code into IC of uh, simulation software and check how it works. Now let us learn how to download Keel for 8051. So in the search bar, write Keel for 8051 download, and in the first option, and uh, now click on the first option Keel downloads. There are various types of keels. So for there, there are many keels for ARMs, for C51, and there are other microcontrollers. So setup for different microcontroller is different. MKD ARM is for ARM microcontroller, C251 is for 80251 devices and for 8051 we have uh, C51 so just click on this link. Now we have to write our name, let's see ABC, last name EF, email ABCDAF, at the rate of Gmail. Com. Now company X Y Z job title right. country region. So now select country India. After filling up the input, so download C51 using this link. Stop now. Save now. Similarly, for downloading the Proteus. Now for Proteus, we have to download Proteus 8.6 version. Now go to this software. Now we have to go to the first link. And in that link, download your software from this link. As you have downloaded both the software, Skill, Proteus at Professionals, 
install both the softwares and after installation these two icons will appear on your desktop feel microvision 5 and protest it professional now i have made a small program for blinking of led on port p1 in which delay is given by this function and this is the main function after compiling that program hex file is created and we will use this hex file now this is the Proteus 8 professional software in which I have added one microcontroller, one LED graph and some peripherals to run the microcontroller. Now what we have to do is that double click on the IC, go to the program file, add the program file, add the hex file a program file which is generated by the delay software. now run run the program now what happens led blinks at every one second now it can be checked by using the oscilloscope functionality in the oscilloscope we can see led the time of uh, turning on and turning off the led is 1000 millisecond that is one second as what we have added in our program now if we change the delay to 500 millisecond after the compilation of the program we can check its simulation on protest now as we can see on the graph time has been reduced by half in the next session we will learn how to write program on keel and how to add circuit simulation in protest software thank you for watching